Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Chrono Cross. Last episode we switched bodies with Lynx, so now we're Lynx and we're kind of like dead or something. We're in like a dream world. The graphics are really terrible, but that's how they're supposed to be, so don't judge the game too hard. hard, hard. Don't judge it too badly. Uh, yeah, let's continue. It's locked from the outside. I was trying to get to that save point, but it wouldn't let me. So I guess, let's go see what's up here, I guess. There's a little house. Let's for sure drop this boulder, though. That will... Do something? Let's see. Is this locked? I'm guessing it's locked. Yeah. Alright, well, obviously that boulder is what we're supposed to be doing. So let's go back to the boulder. And drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Boom. So, that'll clear up the chest for us. Let's go get that chest. And then maybe he'll let us inside the house at some point. Let's see, what's what's in here? Revive. Okay, actually, I needed that revive. Can I get in yet? Oh, I know what I need to do. Drop, drop a fruit. While he runs outside to get it, we gotta run inside of his house. Yeah, that's what we're supposed to do. Hey, you, what are you doing in me house? <laughs> hmm, I figured you for another wandering spirit. How many years has it been since a physical being wandered into this world? Very strange indeed. At least so, the world is controlled by chance and chaos. Anything can happen as quick as a wink, nobody knows. Something you have today may have gone tomorrow, just like the berry I'm olden. Important stuff, irreplaceable stuff. All these may come to arm with super little something, something. And what's frightening is, there's been absolutely no meaning to what's happening in our daily lives. Meaning is non-existent no matter what's born, lost, or changed, it's beyond calculation. There'd be no one or nothing watching over you, such is life. I'm going to bed, it's just your rest up. Alright, let's rest up. Bum 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 bum. Oop, I think I messed up my controller. Alright, let's go see what's up. Can we grab this? Just a second there. I'll give you a place to sleep and you're leaving without a word of thanks. I'm coming with you. Okay. <laughs> I have feeling I I have a feeling I can get out of here if I tag along. Besides, you won't be able to make it outside that tower alone. I'll open it for you. Alright. We got my boy Sprig. Got my boy Sprig. Um, yeah, let's go down real quickly. Let us see what is downstairs. Of course, let's check out as much of the map as we can. Oh, it's a save point. Actually, that's exactly what I needed. Let's go ahead and save. We're going to save to a different slot just because this is like a pivotal part of the game. Oh, can I? Do I have to go all the way back up? Seriously. Okay, so let's keep going. Boom, boom. And let's head up to that tower. Because that's um, what I'm guessing he means. Is... Oh, wrong way. Go through here. Oh, by the way. Does... Do I still have the same equipment? No. Okay, so I have that on. Uh, let's put... I'm going to put Iron Helmet. Uh, do, 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 do. Probably put gold. You know what? No, we'll put power glove. I wonder which one's. Oh, the dragoon gauntlet's bigger. Put two dragoons helmets. Uh, silver staff, iron mail. Let's go ahead and put gold earrings on him, iron helmet, and then. Uh, let's improve his magic defense. And then what about this stuff? Oh, it's all cleared. Okay, so we're going to have to do all of this. Okay, so I've got all of their elements done. Oh, my controller. Okay, so I'll just kind of scroll through here. I'm not going to go through all of it, but if there's his. And then Sprig literally only has two spots. I just put a revive and heal all on him. 
Alright, let's keep moving. Oh, okay, we gotta go up. Well, let's keep moving. Bum, 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 bum. And then he'll be able to let us inside of this house, which is nice. Now, this part is very, very annoying. You'll see why. You are late. Come on, one swirling. So let's go. We don't have the time to be dawdling here. We may truly get lost in time. I can't afford to lose you just yet. Exactly. You are one swirling. So you are no longer Surge. That kind of sucks. You look at yourself. Who in, their, who in their right mind is going to believe you are Surge? Everybody except for yourself says that you are Lynx. You are Monster Lynx. It is simple as that. Is that who you are? Uh, can't go against it. Reality will crush you. Reality will continue to go on as if nothing ever happened from yesterday to today and from today to tomorrow, leaving your, crush, leaving your crushed body behind. I am Lynx. Bravo. You're Lynx. <laughs> Whoa. Regarding your memory as you may be able to rewrite it if you use the dragon tear. In reality, you died 10 years ago in the other world. How can you say for sure that this is the real you? Maybe for you it is evident, but I wonder if you ever really were a Surge. Furthermore, what is Surge? A figure, a shape, a spirit, a soul, where is Surge? Who am I? Who are- what, you're not me, I'm not you, I'm in reality, you are- Something trippy. Somebody's doing way too many drugs, clearly. Okay. So. What? I don't know what any of this means. Do I just have to follow that guy? I'm so confused. Okay, so we did just have to follow him. How boring. Fine, I understand how you feel. Let's head back to reality. All right, let's do this, Harl. Oh, we get Harl on our team. Look at that. Beautiful. I actually like Harl. She's actually one of my favorite characters. Oh, a lot of music. Oh, do we need this? No, okay. Wait, no, we need this to be gone. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Oh, these... Okay, well, let's fight one of these things just so I can show you guys obviously what, like, they are. Man, this place is trippy, though. Like, little... What are they, Wait, what are they called? Total Chaos. Oh, come on. And then, let's just use Magma Bomb, why not? Bum, bum, bum. And I want to attack with Harl and Sprig. We haven't attacked with either of them yet. Let's go with Harl. Pretty sure she uses a slingshot, right? Yeah. Oh, we missed? That's fine. I do want to show you guys what Sprig does. What Sprig does is actually really, really cool. So, okay, he attacks normally, right? Okay, well, we need to get up to five. So he can use a special ability, Doppelganger. So he can transform himself into an enemy that we fought beforehand. So let's turn into Cat Burglar. So he literally turns into that creature. 
So he's fairly weak, but once he turns into a different creature, he becomes a bit stronger. Uh, let's go to Lynx. So we're fighting alongside Cat Burglar. Let's go over here. Let's see kind of how he attacks. Oh, he missed. Oh, he missed too. And actually, I'm pretty sure he gets the move set of the Cat Burglar. I'm curious. I want to hit at least like one. Dude, come on. What? Dude, how do you miss like 10 attacks in an actual row? What? Go back to Cat Burglar. What is this? Dude. You gotta be kidding me, right? No, I, I'm i gonna hit this guy with the Cat Burglar. Or is this guy's like evade way too high for the Cat Burglar or something? Okay, we clearly can't hit him. Because... That's just... That's kind of annoying at this point. Dude, seriously? Fine, I guess we'll just ice... We probably should have Proton Beamed him, but... This is kind of annoying at this point. I don't know why it wouldn't let me hit him. Can I hit him now since he's frozen? Dude, that's... That's like all sorts of messed up. Dude, how are we supposed to kill him? Oh, wait a minute. Did he turn... What a weird... Wait. Okay, I was like, what a weird thing. Let's do Triple Fist. What a weird enemy. He has to, like, turn around for us to hit him. Bam. Okay, that's not too powerful, but you know what? That's fine. Bam. There we go. And I didn't show you Harl's special moves, but... We're gonna get to it eventually. But man, those enemies really are annoying. They're uber annoying. Does this hole do anything? I don't think so. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, I wanna get that chest. Oh well. Uh. No. I'm trying to get past him. There we go. Uh, where do I go? Do I drop? Yeah. Got a drop in this hole. Spooky dookie. Oh, we made it back to reality. So it's literally that easy to make it back to reality. We're back at the Hydra Marshes. We are back to reality. This is the place look familiar. Uh, no, I already know. We're at the Hydra Marshes. Ah, you remember. Then let's leave. Ah, yes, yeah, so finally back to the real world. Ah, world of substance. Even the water in there is different. This is great. Alright, cool. It's time to party. Let's have a toast to our return in the real world. Hmm. <laughs> That seems happy. Listen, old lady, you're not getting any younger. Try to control your emotions. Sure, bus kill. So where to now? Uh, you seem to be worried about the search character. Do you still remember? It's a place where it all started. Where angels lose their way. Yes, I do. I do. Where angels, whatever. It's a bad ring to it. So what exactly is it? You get to another world, something like that. What, are you saying there's another dimension distortion in this world? Very interesting indeed. So where is this place? Fossa Beach. Let's get going, my dudes. What is that place? What the... Spirit, what's going on? Um... Yeah, I was like, this isn't another teleporting place, right? Um... Okay. First... Uh, did we do... We didn't allocate Harl's elements, did we? Okay, I'm gonna do that real quick. Alright, so we got the elements done. Oh. Let's go over here. So, uh, okay, so she has Mithril, which is even better than Iron. Uh, I think I have an Iron Helmet, right? Iron Helmet, Power Glove, 
and then improves hit chance. I think that's probably our best chance. Let's do that. Okay, and I think she's set. Oh, no. No, so let's make our way to Opasa Beach then, I guess, right? Only other place to go. Dun, 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 dun. By the way, we should probably... Yeah, do that. There we go. So this is home world. This way, we'll know which world we're in. And obviously, so since now we're Lynx, basically all interactions with everybody will be different because we're Lynx, not Surge. Let's try to use the Astral Amulet. Well, we can't because we're in the wrong body. What's wrong, Lynx? Don't tell me the dimension gate won't open. Well, you must be in hot water. Of course it won't open. Uh, there's nothing we can do. We just an unwanted piece. Very interesting. What are you going to do now, Lynx? Uh... Alright, guys. So, I don't exactly know what to do. But, I guess two places we can check is Serge's house and Termina. Huh. Demi-humans? What do you monsters want from us? Man, these people are racist against demi-humans, man. Excuse my geezer, what kind of attitude is that? I'll kick your something if you... I will kick your derrier to the moon if you talk to Monster Link like that. Wow! Just like Kid would say. Ah, freak. Doesn't Kid have that exact line but in uh, Australian? <laughs> okay, this is not our house. We gotta go to Serge's house. I forgot which one is Serge's house. Oh wait, no, no, it's the one... It's over to the left. Yeah, it's this one, right? Maybe? Well, yeah, it is this one. Who might you be? May I help you? What? What did you just say? Your Surge? <laughs> Please explain to me exactly what is going on here. Okay, now we explained it. Blah, blah, blah. I see. So that man told you to go to the Sea of Eden. I really don't know about the dimensional distortions or about the other world, but if, like, you say something big is really happening, uh, blah, blah, blah. I made it all started 14 years ago on the night of the storm. Story time. That night, your father was Zuki, and his friend Miguel set out to the sea just despite a storm. It was an emergency. They were swallowed by the high waves and lost consciousness. When they came to, they found themselves inside the Dead Sea, a place where no living creature dares enter. I don't know what he saw or what happened, but that incident changed your father. And your father's friend Miguel, that was Lena's father, he never returned. Back then, that place wasn't called the Dead Sea. It's, I believe, it was called the Sea of Eden. That was 14 years ago. Are you the ones everyone's talking about? No, this can't be. Are you Lynx? You're still alive. Step outside, Lynx, for I, too, was once a valiant member of the Acacia Dragoons. I must put a stop to you. <laughs> uh, this old man. Thinks he could battle us. Silence. Now step outside. Well, I guess we're not stepping outside. I guess we're stepping right here. Um. I love how they even have a battlefield for the town. On guard. Okay, dude, this guy is not gonna... Okay, this guy is good dodge, apparently. Ow. You know, let's just go to Sprig. Let's make Sprig change forms. Okay, let's go to Harl. Alright, dude, this guy's evade is really good for being an old man. Jeez. We've missed so many of our attacks, it's actually annoying. Go to Lynx. Alright, good hits. Let's use Feral Cats. Let's try to get Sprig up to... There we go. Now we should be able to transform. Long shot. 
Eh, it shouldn't hurt too much. Alright, let's go ahead and doppelgang. Let's go ahead and turn into a Lagoonate. I'm pretty sure this is the strongest thing you can turn into at the moment. And we've actually never seen one of these, so it's kind of a lie. But, yeah. I'm pretty sure that's, that's the strongest thing you can turn into. Got some good damage. Moonshine. Oh wait, this is to protect all members. I didn't mean to do that. But I guess let's see what it does, right? Does it just buff all of us? Oh, okay, so that's just magic defense. Photon beam. I really don't think it's fair that he has to take on three of us, though. Oh, that didn't do anything. Let's see what this Lagune can do. Oh, 130. That is... Dude, what is... That damage? Jeez. That's busted. Inferno, I'm pretty sure that's a big AoE attack. That didn't hurt that bad. See if we can hit. Okay, we can't. That's fine. Let's try to hit him with links. His this guy's evade is crazy though. I stand defeated. Yeah, that lagoon thing. That thing is strong. At least against that guy. We should probably turn into him more often. I like it though. Hmm. I do not sense any malice in your attacks. Do you really mean to tell me that you're not Lynx, and is it true that the General is still active in the other world? Here, the General has been missing for the past three years. Understood, I shall accompany you. We may still have a chance to save the General and Riddle in the other world. Um... I guess he's joined the party? Yeah, I guess we'll just keep him. I should probably change him out for Sprig. Yeah. Um, but we have to take Sprig's stuff off. So, we'll do that in a minute. We must gather news in the term- We must gather news in Termina about General Vipers. We may find clues. I radius shall give up my all in the name of General Viper. Okay. So what we're gonna do, let's head outside, let's change his stuff, and then we will for sure, we're going to put Radius in, because I like him better than Spriggs. Let's go to Equips, give him Ivory Vest, put, leave that on, take that off, take that off, oh, nope, bam, Teleporter. Go ahead and get Radius in here. Put Harl. There we go. I like. I want Harl to be second. By the way, just a little point thing to point out. Do you know? Did you see the similarities between Lynx and Harl and Surge and Kid? I'm just gonna put that out there. Dun, dun. Actually, we need ointments, right? Yeah. There we go. And let's go ahead. Oh, I gotta equip. My dude Radius over here. Wait. Does okay, Marl has a Mithril Mail. Uh gold earrings. Let's put Iron Helmet and I guess a power glove. Yep. And then let's allocate his elements. Oh, he has quite a table. Alright, we've got his elements and equips all set. I'm pretty sure now. Before the poor soldiers were blocking this, they are no longer blocking it. Hey, check out that guy's face. Uh, our investigation is done. Let's get out of here. I want to go back to poor. So let's just try to uh, juke this guy. Yep, there we go. Juked. And let's go make sure there's nothing different. Is a bird? There is a bird up there. Let's go see if there's anything different up here. Just in case. Doo, 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 doo. There is 
chest? Let's grab these chests. Infrared vision frame. Okay, cool. So that's like a different text border we can use, but I like my first one, honestly. Bum, 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 bum. Let's see what this is. Mithril. Okay, we're going to need that to craft some of the mithril elements. I guess let's go see what's down here. Do, do, do. Okay, there's a chest. Oh. Yeah, I think we're gonna end up fighting the bird, but I wanna grab this. Oh, just mithril. Actually, we don't even need to fight the bird. Honestly, the bird used to be a strong enemy, but at this point in the game, it's really not strong anymore. It won't give me a lot of XP. There's really no reason to fight it. But guys, I think we will be ending off the episode here if there's not another cutscene right here. Let me just outrun that. So guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as my channel. And next time we're going to go to Termina. So God bless and goodbye.